What's going on, people? It's Flight Sports. Listen, the whole situation with Skip Bayless, we got more news. This is crazy. Uh, for him to come out today with his utterly disgusting statements, talking about, um, you know, this, that, and the third, it's just, it's just, it's just nasty, man. Skip Bayless is crazy. He need to put that tweet down. He said he's not going to put it out. Before we get into the whole situation, first things first, I want to send my prayers to DeMar Hamlin and his whole entire family, the Buffalo Bills, because at the end of the day, uh, while we discussing all of this, we should never, you know, forget the bottom line in this whole situation is that somebody literally um, almost lost their life, you know, on the floor, you know, on the field, pardon me. So we got to always remember that, you know, uh, we got to put that into full totality and consideration, you know, on what's going on. But um, the doctors have came on a set of progression, you know, is, and this is, this is so upsetting because I feel like this gets lost in the shuffle, you know, because we get so caught up with Skip and we totally forgetting what's the main priority here, which is DeMar, you know, um, he's still in critical condition, you know, but the doctors did say they are seeing some progression. You know, they have, we don't know everything just yet. As more information comes out, we will be documenting that. So make sure you hit the like button. You definitely subscribe to Flight Sports TV so you stay in tune to what's going on as the news comes out. But um, let's get straight into it. Let's not waste a whole lot of time. Uh, Shannon Sharp returned today, you know, bottom line. So what happened was this dude, um, pardon me, Skip Bayless, it was, it was all of this happened in the opening monologue, right? So, mind you, you had Shannon Sharp. I I don't know what happened, but from it seemed like Skip was blindsided by this, you know, this occurrence, you know. But it, it, it I like what he did. Shannon Sharp knew he was going. He got to bring this up for for Skip to think this was. I mean, I, that's crazy that they wanted to basically bring Shannon on the show to silence him. But in so many words, Shannon opened up the monologue discussing about DeMar Hamlin. And uh, he has never seen a player, you know, require, you know, CPR and, and really be revived on the floor, you know, he on the field part of me. He'd never seen that, you know. So he, he brought up his brother, you know, having having a, a serious issue, you know, on the floor, you know, on the field as well, you know, a, a serious medical condition, you know, so he but it was never to this magnitude. You know, so I think with Skip Bayless, it, it was definitely he needed to be addressed. You know, for Skip to think he was they was going to roll on this show and his business as usual. I think that's that's hurtful and it's disgusting. You know, it's starting to, the more and more this is coming out is making him look worse. You know, and Skip Bayless stood his ground. Y'all Shannon Sharp told him directly on the show. Skip, I hope Skip, you take that tweet down. You know what Skip Bayless told this man, y'all? Skip Bayless told him, look, listen, I'm not, I'm not taking nothing down. You understand? He, not, he said, I stand by what I said, and I refuse to take this tweet down. You know, so, I mean, it, it was definitely, you know, crazy to say the least, man. You know, um, it's wild what's, what's all going on with this whole situation. I want to know how this whole situation is going to end involving, you know, the whole situation with Skip and Shannon. But they was really arguing like two you know, like two people, like two cup, like a couple ready to break up. You know, that's the way they were arguing today. You know, uh, Shannon Sharp was trying to speak. Skip Bayless continued to interrupt him, would not allow him to finish his statements, you know, which is disgusting, you know, but it is what it is. Y'all let me know y'all thoughts on the situation. What did y'all take from this whole, you know, political engagement between these two um these two guys, you know, in my humble opinion, I thought it was crazy, you know, to have them bickering like this. You know, I can't wait till this is over. They need to be separated. I think that's clear as day. I think Shannon needs a new host. And I, as you can see, Skip, he might be running the show all by himself. You know, Skip Bayless is too much of a control freak. You know, and you've seen that today. You know, for him to say he didn't even, he thought they wasn't going to bring it up. It's almost like they, they, they coached each other before the going on the show, what was going to be said. And, and, you know, Shannon, he had to stand up. He brought up uh, pretty much like the camaraderie it is, you know, that, that brotherhood of, of the NFL to see basically he was, in so many words, he was standing with his NFL 
brothers you understand you know the whole nfl family when he basically did not come to work you know that day and he definitely had to step up and say something you know so i don't know where skip goes from this you know because he he said he's not going to delete that tweet when does fox step in you know because and then skip says that basically um they had, went, basically the network had nothing that had no problem with what was going on with the situation i feel like the network eventually has to address what's all going on here you know you got your two you know my undisputed is probably they they best show you know uh let me know if there's something else that's moving the needle better than undisputed you know but it, you got to figure out what's going on you know these two clearly seem like it's just it's just a working relationship there's no it's no nothing, you know, besides they just basically on here to do the show and go home. That's what it seems like is going on. It don't seem like it's no more or no less, you know, so I don't know if that's something that we need to monitor a little closer, you know, but it is what it is at the end of the day. You know, I believe that uh, this, this situation with Skip Bayless needs to get rectified and quicker than quicker. You know, I don't want this can't continue to linger. You had Terrell Owens come back out today and made some statements in regards to my man. Not well, in regards to Skip Bayless, part of me, you know, um, shout out Shannon Sharp. You know, he's doing the best he can. They, of course, did they did they normal dudes. They got into LeBron. They got into Brady. You know what they do. Uh, this is pretty, you know, this is what they talk about, you know. So it is what it is. It was unfortunate, you know, that. You know, he couldn't put this to bed. It's bad enough that the damage is already done. And it's, it's like he just continues to make it worse, you know, almost by speaking. I think it's to the point now he need to just say next subject and say, you know, what I refrain from speaking on this. You know, you've even had it was a different situation, but we all know Bulls guard Kyrie. You know, he a part of me. Um, Brooklyn Nets guard Kyrie Irving. You know, he basically had a situation. We're not going to get all into it. Um, he, he removed the, the, the post, you know, and like I said, I just feel like obviously this is two different situations, but people are people. It, 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 you, you say you're sorry. You get on national television, break down in tears. That's what I'm going to close with. You on national television with, with crocodile tears, you know, you, you, you conveying so much emotion. You all of these things, all of this, all these sentiments. And then when Shannon Sharp, I think that was your time right there, you know, to to show even more, you know, even more sorrow for the situation. Shannon says, Skip, I hope you take that down. You know, Skip should, you, you see the emotion coming from Shannon. You put Shannon in a tough spot. And I told y'all this the last time we talked. She, Skip is not being considerate that this is his NFL brothers. You understand you, you you got this is not you, this is this is his this is family at the end of the day and it's like skip trying to make him choose you know this is not going to end well you know that was your his time to say I, i'm sorry y'all you know i'm gonna delete this tweet at my earliest convenience so you could so people could start the healing process because he i don't know if he is living under a rock but people are hurt and i'm gonna leave it at that it's flight sports tv skip baylor says he he, he, listen, he stand on what he said and he would not delete the tweet. This is unfortunate.